Hey girls, hey! Hey boys, hey! I am a hot mess express right now. Um, I am getting ready to get in the shower and I am having to do a bathroom video because I do not want my son to hear what I'm saying. Um, we homeschool during the day, so he's on the other end of the house doing his classwork, and I'm sorry about the bathroom echo, but I wanted to come on here all natural, showing you guys what I normally look like, um, and let you know that I am a creator that gets passionate about things. I get loud. I let people know when I'm feeling emotion, um, so... For those of you that think that I was too loud in my Sherilyn Cadel um, video yesterday, I publicly apologize to you guys. You are free to unsubscribe and keep it moving. One of them was a creator that I actually looked up to and um, I have never hated on her in her comments and I don't agree with half of what she says or the people that she has on. But I'm not going to mention any names because this is not what my channel is about. And so as you guys can see, I put in a lot of work for those of you that saw the stacks and stacks of paper of my notes and things that I have brought to the content of this channel. I want to make it clear that it, this is not about subscribers to me. This is about a voice for the victims. This is about invading the privacy of villains that invaded the privacy of victims, okay? And so we just want to educate you guys and get things out there. Everything I have found, I found in the Discovery, I found in Sherilyn's book. I am now covering the Wisconsin confession interviews and that's where I'm finding some of the stuff. And so if you don't agree with me, if you can't say it without being catty and kind of backhanded or jabby, um, you will be deleted. It's not about subscribers for me anymore. Um, I did want to get over a thousand so I could go live on YouTube, but I'm there and I have like maybe 1,200 or close to it. And so I could use to lose 50 subscribers a day if you guys aren't here for the right intentions. I want to hear your scenarios. I want to hear your theories. I want to hear everybody's theories. But as soon as you start jabbing at me, jabbing at the victims, or baiting me in my comments, then you're going to be blocked. And I don't have very much patience. I've got two happy blocking fingers that already have a huge list of people there. So other creators, they let their haters stay because they just want the subscribers, but that's not what my channel is about. My channel is about dissecting the information that we have been giving given and um, finding out together by putting our heads together what really happened and filtering between the lies and the facts. And we can't do that if we can't act like adults and have adult conversations. And so I support all the creators on YouTube and I would never go in their comments and start trash talking them. Um, maybe the old me would have, I probably have in the past, but that once I started my channel, I decided that I was going to be genuine, no matter how bad it made me look, and that I wasn't going to get out of my character because of comments, and I wasn't going to let this be something negative for me. So be careful with what you say. I will block you for the littlest thing because it's about getting friends here and putting our heads together and meeting new people and having an outlet for all this information that I have on the Watts case. And I am, my dad was a police officer. I always wanted to be a lawyer growing up. And so this is what interests me, you guys, is getting to the truth. And so anyone that makes a snide comment that is digging at another subscriber, 
that is digging at another YouTuber, that is digging at me, even if it's passive aggressive, you're gone. Because I only need people here that are gonna support me. I have a Facebook full of fake friends. And so I would just go live on my Facebook if I was looking for fake friends. I am looking for genuine people. This is a channel to share survivor stories of domestic violence and addiction. And I have so many guests that have already said that they will come on. So if you want to stay here and get the self-help and to get the stories of other people that have survived, then stay here and I'll give it to you. But be nice. I got to go. My son's yelling. Bye.